game five, we in Miami. Huge, huge game is tied 2-2. The history speaks for itself. Paul Pierce, you know, a guy that I battled a lot in Eastern Conference up until that point. He's dribbling the ball, and, and I'm sitting down in one of the best defensive stands I've had in my career. He raises up, tight ass game. They, they're up two, and he shoots a three. If I would have got any close, I would have been inside his uniform, and he drains it in my face. And just like. sunk into my head. The next day, we have to travel to Boston for game six, and um, I felt nothing. I felt absolutely nothing. And for the first time, I played in Boston so many times during the playoffs, during the regular season. I always felt like this is gonna be tough. I'm in Boston, this is, you know, this really ain't a, an American-friendly place feel a certain way, but for this one time when I went to Boston for this game six, I felt absolutely nothing. The day before and the day of the game, I said absolutely nothing to nobody. And my headphones on. Listen to some great music. And when the game started, I felt, I felt nothing. And that was the result of feeling nothing. James blows past Pearson, throws it down. He's knocking down everything. James gets it to go. James for three. LeBron James put the heat on his shoulders and carried them to this dominant victory. I wish I could bottle nothing up, I tell you that. People say if we lose that game, then the big three possibly get broken up just after two years. Well, that whole year was. That whole year, and when, and that's why I think I was able to win a championship that year. And obviously, you got to have some things that guys playing well, my teammates, the coaching staff, everybody aligned. But I think first year, I just got away from like I'm not that guy. Who feels right? Where does he uniform? This is the worst thing that could have ever happened. This is to me. terrible. This is the worst thing that could ever happen to Cleveland. Oh, you think it's that easy? Huh? He is dead to me. I'm not that guy. I know who I am. This is what I am. 27 at this point. This is who I am. Let's, let's go get it this year. I don't know, man. It's like, it's like a, a master psalm. Finally getting this vindication that I'm that guy. I know how to do I can I can smell the, I can smell the barrels. I know exactly. That's a cab from 2004 vintage from those vines in that region. And that's how I felt at that moment. That is an uh, African-American badass from Akron, Ohio. He's the best player in the world. That's what I felt like.